What's banging and swinging, LA, you gang gang? This your girl, Lynn, back with another video. And today, I just wanted to drop in and give you guys a follow-up um, on what I've been doing since I've left my job. So, if you guys saw my other video, <laughs> which I will link it down in the description box if you haven't seen it, um, it's about my new chapter my new journey this year the things that i'll be doing well i wanted to get on here today to let you guys know when god tell you to do something do it trust him believe in him believe that he is going to take care of you regardless of what you are doing. I'm getting a little teary out right now because I'm just, I'm so full with the fact that knowing he is in the midst of this new journey that I'm walking. He's leading me and guiding me every step of the way. So, if you guys new to my channel, um, I want to let you know. My name is Lynn. Um, the last video that I posted um, that I'm going to link down in the description is about me actually walking away from my job. I was making a significant amount of money. But this video today is to encourage someone that is sitting on the fence. They know what their assignment is and they're scared to take the leap. Well, I'm here to tell you today, have faith, believe what he says because he gonna do what he says. Y'all just gonna have to excuse me because this video it's going to touch somebody. I don't know who, but I'm getting it out here. I'm just doing my assignment. It's for somebody. Well, anyway, let me let you guys know the little background. Okay, last year, December 31st, December 30th was the last day at my, my job. I, what I did was I was a signal engineer and I was making a pretty good significant amount of money. Um, I love the people I work with. I enjoyed my job, but it just was not fulfilling my spirit. <clears throat> my spirit was just not there anymore. And when your spirit is bothered, it's time to make a change. So, I had prayed and fast before I decided to walk away. And I, needless to say, the answer was, don't move, don't go forward into another year without doing what I said you were supposed to do. What you supposed to do. So, I did it. I walked away. Well... What I'm doing now is I have two businesses that I'm in the process of juggling. <laughs> Not one, but two. And one of the businesses is my purpose for being here. It's my purpose. Um, What I'm doing, one of my businesses is that I'm about to build is a nonprofit organization that actually supports burn survivors. So what the the foundation, the name of the foundation is called Mold to Perfection Foundation. So I'm raising money to get that foundation started and off the ground. And what I'm doing to raise the money, um for this foundation is a candle business. As y'all can see, 
If y'all can't see, I will show y'all. This table, my desk, is full of candle su supplies. That's where I've been. I've been ghost for a while, and that's this is it's because I'm trying to get my candles going. So the candle is symbolic to me because, of course, the flame represents the fire, and to me, the mold represents the body, and that's why I decided to name my company Mold to Perfection foundation so needless to say my candle company is just called mold to perfection candles and the um <laughs> oh gosh okay that's the name of my candles and i'll show you guys um a picture of my logos for both businesses so those two businesses I consider um, as one. Well, my second business that I'm going to be doing um, is a logistics company. It's now this business is actually already formulated. This is a formed business, and I'm about to get started in that. So it's called CGI Logistics, and it's a um, transportation logistics company for um dispatching for now <laughs> so i'll be doing dispatching i'll be dispatching truck drivers um which like semi drivers box truck drivers any type of drivers that may need loads i'll be dispatching them and then i'll get a percentage of whatever of the loads that they dispatch so to this month, I have just been inundated with my candle business. This business is really my number one. This is my number one baby because this is something that is near and dear to my heart. This is part of my purpose. So... The month of January, <laughs> so far, I, I have just been inundated in all of this. So, needless to say, I haven't been looking for drivers for my for my dispatching uh, services um, because of this. Um, um, so, I was I was thinking about it the other night and I was like, Lord, I got it. I got to start looking for drivers, you know. Um, but I really want to get my candle business going. So um, it's kind of like it's priority. So um, I, you know, I haven't really harped on the fact that, you know, I haven't been searching for the drivers. But I said, you know, I know I'm doing what I'm supposed to do. Um, either way it go, you know, everything is going to work out how it's supposed to. Well, with all that being said, my husband gets a text. He got a text from one of his friends. And his friends, one of his friends has a friend. <laughs> That's about to get into... Um, Sprint vans and box trucks. So, he reached out to my husband and my husband gave me his number. And I called him back today. And needless to say, he wants me to dispatch him. Now, I just told y'all. <laughs> I haven't been focusing on that business like I should. But God. But God. That's all I can say. It came to me. 
when you're doing what you're supposed to do, and it's deemed right in the eyes of God, you gonna get what you need, even if you're not looking for it. You gonna get what you need. So for everybody that's out there, if God has called you to do something, trust, believe, and have faith that it's going to work out because it will. His word will never come back void. My candle business. These candles, 50% of the proceeds, the purchases of these candles goes towards my building this foundation. And the other 50% goes to continuing to make them. I'm not making anything off these candles and any other items that I'm doing, I'm making. But I am not concerned with that. That's not my concern. My concern is doing what I was told to do. And this makes me feel amazing because I know it's not for me. This is for to bless somebody else. God has been good to me. And now I want to be a blessing. In the other's lives. I got to give back. And that's why I'm doing this. So. If anybody. Feels the need. To want to. Um, be a blessing. And contribute. To. Um, helping me grow my foundation I will leave my um, cash app in the description box I'll leave my email um, if you would you're interested in purchasing candles you can also reach me through my email um, my social medias are also linked in the, the, the description box but this video is not for that. You don't have to. Please don't feel obligated to do so because God will provide. <laughs> but if you do feel that your spirit is leading you to do so, I will have that information for you. And God knows I, I want to say thank you in advance if you choose to do so. <laughs> But this video is mainly for the people who are sitting idle on your purpose. Get up and move. If he has told you your assignment, start working on your assignment and keep your eyes on your assignment. And I guarantee you everything will start coming together. So with that being said, I gotta get my my um my packet off to my my new driver today. Um and the great thing about it is he won't be ready to start until next month. That gives me an abundance of time to continue to work on my candles. So 
that was perfect as well. He is he's his name his nickname is Smokey. <laughs> but um he seems like a great guy and I cannot wait to meet him and I'm going to do everything I can to try to keep him his his wheels turning on his on his sprint vans and his box trucks when he gets those. So, I'm really looking forward to working with him. But but you guys, um, I'm not going to keep you in there longer. I just wanted to let you guys know what's been going on with Lynn. Um, your girl is working. She's over here trying to get things done and, and just walking with her eyes closed and letting God lead the way. So, <laughs> you guys be blessed. Keep me in your prayers and, um... Thank y'all for coming to stop by, by the channel to view this video. Uh, if you haven't subscribed and you made it this far, I hope you enjoy the con you enjoy the content. And if so, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and follow your girl's journey because there's more to come. There's going to be much more to come. Love you guys. Peace, love, and blessings. Check you guys later. Peace out. Thanks for tuning in. Hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. See you in the next video.